may want to know what is a line level. Well, because <laughs> I don't think I made that clear. The bubble goes back and forth, right? See it? And right now it's showing level. Can you see it? Because the bubble's right in the middle, right between the two black lines. You see these little hooks right there on the end, right? That goes on the line. When I say line, I mean masonry line. Uh, what's the other one? Home Depot or probably any neighborhood uh, store for two to three dollars. I don't know, two, three, four dollars. Maybe even cheaper. Maybe a dollar, two dollars. It turns the entire masonry line into a level. The pipe that's used in this dome is electrical. Um, it's electrical conduit and you can see let me see now if I can get that in the picture uh, right there it says sunlight resistant all right now this is electrical conduit it's gray in color I don't know if you can tell by the video but it's gray in color uh, it can be found in the electrical department your dome shelter according to the blueprints that you can order at wickerjungle.com uh, is made out of 100% uh, electrical. Why? Why electrical conduit? The reason we use electrical conduit is because it is stronger, it is sunlight resistant, unlike what they call pressure pipe, the white PVC pipe that you see uh, for plumbing, that's called pressure pipe. All right, this is uh, different. So um, it's cheaper, it's stronger, it's sunlight resistant. That's a good reason to use this. This, uh, this is glue. All right. You see how I have it taped together? Let me see. See there? Three cans taped together. Isn't that great? Why do I do that? Uh, I learned that trick of the trade from plumbers. Plumbers do that because uh, when you have three cans taped together, it keeps it from tilting over and spilling the material. It also allows you to carry this as a package from one pipe to the next as you're working because one of them is purple cleaner this one here is purple cleaner that you have to clean the end of the pipes uh, you have to prep them and clean them and it softens the pipe ready for it to glue then the other two cans you see here are just two different sizes of glue again all the details that are necessary for for your uh, dome system are in the blueprints. The blueprints can be ordered at wickerjungle.com. We've accomplished right much. All right, what you see there on the top is going to be the uh, uh, the outlet for the stove, and uh, you can see the plastic on the ground here. Now, what that is is. That's two layers of six mil plastic. I recommend, as you can see, it's clear, or it looks white in this video. That plastic uh, is about $100 a roll, um, but it's 100 feet, so you can actually get two layers of plastic and then make you a cover out of it. Um, greenhouse plastic is really not much more expensive if you shop online and greenhouse plastic is uh, lasts three times as long so you, you're going to get like three or four years use in direct sunlight right so what I've done since the last video you remember all you saw last video was dirt all right now there's what I've done is I take lumber covers and I lay it on the dirt what are lumber covers uh, you find it at lumber yards lumber stores Lowe's hardware and when the, the uh, lumber comes in on the train, it's covered with a, a cover. Uh, it's, it's similar to tarpaulin, and you can get them free sometimes at the uh, hardware store. So I get, get them when I can. So I laid the layer of those on the ground and covered the dirt. All right. Leave me, Carol, and take me.
Spanish care.